Hey guys, Moan Pobero here and today I'm going to share with you Grant Cardone's top three rules for success. Let's get to it. So hey, my name is Moan Pobero. This channel is all about me sharing and documenting and, and sharing my journey in business. I've been involved in more than 10 businesses, seven figure businesses, and I'm here to share with you what worked for me, what didn't work for me, and also share with you some ideas based on different topics. I want to talk today on Grant Cardone's because I love that guy. I mean, and I'm trying to basically buy whatever I can from everyone out there who's doing something that I'm not yet. And he's probably one of the reasons that I started this YouTube channel. I saw him doing things in real estate that you can say I'm doing in business, but then I saw how he's leveraging his YouTube followers, basically or all over the place followers, to go out there and raise a fund in real estate. And it's something that I really appreciate. And if you want to watch my other videos on the channel, I'm here to share and document my journey, going out there and buy existing businesses versus starting them from scratch. I think actually it's much better than real estate because in real estate there's only so much you can leverage with businesses i mean first of all the upside is just insane there's only i mean i don't know a business uh, sorry a real estate that can grow 10 times in a year in a business it's possible or two or three times a year in business it's definitely doable if they have the right strategies and access to the right people and that's what this channel is all about but today i really want to focus on on some of the biggest lessons i got from uh, grant cardone and how you can implement them in your life as well so the first lesson I got from him and really kind of like try to in integrate it in my life is that success is your duty and obligation. It's a must. He's, he's demanding it. And what it means, based on the way I see it, is that, guys, life is so short. Success is your duty. And it's not just about external success. It's basically about more about internal success. It's about giving the best that you can out there in the world and fulfilling your potential. You don't want to live an average life. Live an average, you're, this is not the reason that you're here for. Life is short. There's only, there's a small chances of you even being here. And when you're here, you want to make the most out of it. It means in all over the biggest area in your life, in your health, wealth, love, happiness, you want to become the best that you can in those areas. And life is about growth, it's about expansion. This is literally our purpose in life here, is to expand and, and become more and be more and do more and give more. And unless you're doing that, you're literally holding yourself back and you probably have some, probably some issues that you need to figure out with yourself. But you literally need to feel that day to day, that this is your obligation, your duty. You got to become more, you got to be more, you got to give more. And that's the only way to really be fulfilled and happy and, and live a joyful life. That's what I believe and that's what Grants believe. And that's probably the most important first rule that I, I love from him. The second rule that I, that I took from Grant is work hard and it's about producing and obviously Grant is all about the 10x and, and it's about producing more, doing more. Like if you check his YouTube channel, he's uploading at least one video a day and I think I saw like two or three sometimes a day. The amount of production that he has, the amount of uh, initiative that he's taking and that's I think the biggest difference in people that are successful and not those who are successful are the people who are producing more and more and more they are creating things from basically from nowhere and putting them out there into the world versus people who are not successful are usually are usually consumers and Grant I just love his stuff is all about taking action more action and it's all about ignoring people who who tell you otherwise and I'm sure that if you want to start a business or buy a business, you're going to have people around. You're going to tell you, hey, what the fuck you think you're doing? You, 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 you think you're going to be successful at this? And you got to hold yourself back and ignore those things and be uh, or focused mostly on producing and giving and becoming the best version that you can by giving the most amount of value that you can to the world. The other really, really great lesson that I got from Grant is be obsessed. Go for your dream. Don't be afraid of failing and understand that failure is part of the process. But the obsession, and I think the obsession comes down to you understanding and getting to a point where you're enjoying your, your work, you really love your work, and you don't, you don't have a difference between work and play. This has basically become one, and it, your work is your play. Like for me right now, I enjoy my day. Like I don't need a vacation. This is my vacation. This is my way of producing, of giving value to the world. This is what makes me fulfilled. And I talk about it in my other videos, but there's only so many pina coladas you can drink on the beach while doing nothing. In the end of the day, the only way for you to be really fulfilled is by producing, by giving, by basically getting to a point where you can't even differentiate between work and play. And when you're getting to that point, that's when you're becoming obsessed. That's when you understand this is not about you. It's more about other people and giving the most amount of value because most likely you've been through some hard 
times. And at least that's that's for me personally. I've been through some very, very big challenges. And now I am, I value everything that I have so much that I just want to go out there and expand and give to, to everyone out there as much as I can. And just for, for a bonus, the last biggest lessons I got from him is that you got to control your mind, that business is a mental game more than it is a strategy or a skill set game. It's all here. And your business is a reflection of your, your internal beliefs, basically. If you have a problem with your business, I mean, check it out. You most likely have that same similar problem in your personal life or your internal life. And life and business is an internal game in the end of the day. I definitely believe in that. And Grant is all also talking about getting advice from the right people. Don't get advice from an overweight person on how to become wealthy and how to become fit. If you want to learn about doing things in real estate, go out there and learn from Grant Cardone and see what he's doing to go out there and buy real estate. If you want to grow your business organically by doing more sales and marketing, Grant is probably a good person to follow as well. He's the master of doing sales. But if you want to go out there and not start a business from scratch by buy existing one or grow your existing business by acquisitions by buying other companies, me and my team are the best at it. Um, my team and I were involved in more than 300 deals and we can definitely help you grow by acquisitions, buy existing businesses. And the difference between that and real estate is that there's a lot of leverage in business that you don't have in real estate. You don't need, mil you don't need millions in the bank to buy a multi-million dollar business. I mean, heck, you don't even need your own money at all many times. Obviously, if you have some capital to play with, it's even better. But that's what we're the best if. At, if you want to explore that, go to moanpober.com forward slash quiz or see the link in the description below. Otherwise, I hope you enjoyed my lessons about Grant Cardone and some of the biggest things that I got from him. I love the man. I hope he's going to continue to put in a, to put as much content out there. I love him. I, I love his wife. I think he's an amazing, amazing woman that you can learn from a lot as well. Uh, but yeah, hope you enjoyed it, guys. And I'll see you soon.